What's up, what's up, everybody? It's your boy, Colin Sadiambo, Kenya's number one inspirational speaker and millennial mindset coach. And welcome to another episode of Colin Celebrates You. Now, on this episode, we're going to be talking about something that we all have to accept, that pain is part of the process. In the 1950s, there was a great psychologist called Dabrowski. He studied the World War II survivors and he came to realize that some of them, a sizable number of them, had actually changed their life because of what they had gone through in the war. A number of them realized that before the war they felt um, entitled, some of them didn't appreciate their loved ones, some of them, you know, will get angry over petty issues. But after going through the World War II, their mindset changed, their perspective changed. They even became happier people. Why? Because after the war, they felt more confident, more sure of themselves, and they were unfazed by little problems and issues that they face in life. The truth of the matter is, they all had scars from the war but some of them decided to leverage uh, from those cars and they changed their perspective in life and they're able to use them to better their life I remember there was one time i came back from work and i found my girlfriend watching a, a tv show it is called um, scars i think it's on switch tv and there's a lady here talking about what she had gone through in her life i mean this lady went through a lot of pain he was a uh, young girl came from a family that uh, you know they were just struggling from the slums grew up struggling he was able to meet this guy they decided to move in they started living together but after a short while the guy became lazy times he will even uh, it will even reach a point where he would beat the lady so bad that at one point the lady started questioning like is this what my life is going to be like do I deserve this? As the story goes, this guy got a job abroad and um, when he left, he forgot about her. He went to the States and is living his life up to this time. But what fascinated me, even though she had gone through all this pain, she said it helped her appreciate life more. And even after the guy left, she realized it wasn't necessary for her to have a man to make her happy, for her to have a man to make her feel peaceful. Because after he left, he was even more happier and even more peaceful. The truth of the matter is, if there's anything worthwhile we've accomplished in life, it's mostly after going through some form of pain. I personally am able to share this uh, talks this to to be in front of a camera and talk with you because of what I'd gone through Because I want to inspire somebody else. I want to inspire especially kids in school I want to show them that listen, you don't have to know everything when you're starting It doesn't have to be easy. You're not, you're not entitled to anything You have to work for it and you can be anything that you want because of what I went through pain is part of the process Pain is part of the journey towards that thing that you want to have in life. Towards that relationship, uh, that health, uh, those financial goals, you have to go through some form of pain. If you want to build muscle, you have to be ready to go through pain when you hit the gym. <laughs> it is not easy. And the other thing you have to, to, you have to understand is uh, growth is an ongoing process. You never reach a point where you're like, okay, this is my end point. That is, that is what we call death. But before you die, you have to continue growing and growing and growing. You understand? After you die, you can't develop yourself. You can't grow. You can't achieve anything. You understand? But if you understand that pain is part of the process, growth is a continuous process, then you understand that pain will always be present in your journey to self-development, in your journey to a better relationship, in your journey to uh, better scores in your studies, in your journey in terms of your finances and your health, you have to understand that pain is part of the process. Not only do you have to know that pain is part of the process, 
but you have to feel the pain. Don't try to cover the pain, you know, with uh, other substances or, you know, ignoring or behaving like uh, you're entitled to anything. You have to face your pain if you want to go to another level. You have to agree. You have to face your pain. If you want to be stronger, you have to face the pain in your gym. If you want to have a better relationship, you have to face the pain of solving problems, of meeting problems head on and facing the facts rather than just trying to ignore and you end up storing them in your heart and then when you explode, you end up hurting someone or something. You have to face these pains. You have to, if you want to improve your financial life you have to you have to discipline yourself in, with your finances and that is a huge challenge and i'm a culprit on that but i have understood that i had to change how i i i, I look at money how i spend money and i had to go through the pain of not having to spend as as much as i wish you understand but pain is part of the process you'll have to feel it and don't try to ignore it this is the only way you're going to elevate your life this is the only way you're going to get to the next level by understanding that okay this is what i want and these are the pains that i have to go, these are the pains that i'll have to go through you understand these are the changes that i'll have to go through because what i've come to learn in in life is at times the changes that we want to experience in our lives actually come with some form of pain with some form of setback or let me just call them some new things you have to do which will not be the usual things you've been doing, which in turn will bring some sort of pain. Understand? So, my encouragement to you today is, understand, for you to go to the next level of your life, you have to accept that pain is part of the process. It won't be easy, <laughs> but you have to do it. And it's an ongoing process. Understand? So, I hope this encourages you. I hope this inspires you to face your goals your challenges head on understanding that there's some pains you have to go through there's some new things you have to face and through doing that you'll become a happier person a more a more confident person and will be the, the kind of person who is not pissed off by petty things in life okay other than that guys remember to like my page Collins Elevates Africa remember to subscribe to my YouTube channel Collins Diambo and follow me on Instagram and Twitter uh, my handle is at Collins underscore EQ. Other than that, guys, remember to love your life, live fully, and create a legacy. Peace.